Good day. The state television company of Western Armenia represents all the most important events of these days. Today's broadcast, press release of the government of Western Armenia, the immediate removal of Azerbaijani armed strongholds near peaceful settlements remains the key problem. Ambassador of Artsakh. As a result of the Azerbaijani prov actions, three Armenian servicemen were killed. We can't live with a Turk. The northern village of Artsakh does not believe in peace. The way to realize the unity and national goals of Eastern and Western Armenia. The message of Aram the First, Catholicos of Great House of Cilicia. Let's get to know the cities of Western Armenia, Zaytun. The press service of government of Western Armenia referring to the speech by the Prime Minister of Western Armenia, Seda Melikian, on the state television of the Republic of Western Armenia reports the work done in 2021 and outlined the works to be done in 2022. She is happy to know that watching the performance covered by the news of Western Armenia TV in YouTube channel, websites, Facebook page, the news had a great response. The government of Western Armenia represented by the speech by the Prime Minister managed to break the vision of life in a closed system for thousands of peoples and open the system and make it clear to Armenians living in the Republic of Armenia and deprived to their homeland as a result of the genocide of Armenian people and spread throughout the world that is necessary to get out of the agent of solving the internal political problems of the Republic of Armenia and consider the state of Armenia and the Armenian issue in an open system. Based on geopolitical perceptions, it should be understood that Armenia has a future only if it sees the solution of its problems in the application for succession and the demand of Western Armenia. Tens of millions of Armenians should unite around the idea of statehood and direct all efforts and intellectual potential to the holy cause. We are waiting for your further feedback. Press Service of Government of Western Armenia. The Ombudsman of the Republic of Artsakh reports that according to some facts, Azerbaijani side had been shelling settlements from positions located near peaceful settlements with greater intensity in recent days. The target of civilian settlements on the part of Azerbaijan is an encroachment on the rights of civilians, first of all, on the right of life. Azerbaijani criminal actions are aimed at immediating, creating an atmosphere of fear and disappear among the population of Artsakh. From the point of view of security and proper protection of the rights of the population of Artsakh, the immediate removal of Azerbaijan armed strongholds near peaceful settlements remains an extremely important and key problem, the Ombudsman of Artsakh said in a statement. According to the press service of Minister of Defense of Armenia on January 11, as a result of prove actions by Azerbaijani units in the eastern direction of Armenian Azerbaijani border, servicemen of the N military unit of the Minister of Defense of Armenia, Private Artur Artomovich Mkhitaryan, born in 2002, and Junior Sergeant Rudy Garibian, born in 2002, were killed. On the same day, at midnight, the body of Vahan Vachagan Babayan, born in 2003, a soldier of Republic of Artsakh Armed Forces, was found with a fatal gunshot wound. The leadership of Western Armenia shared the heavy pain of loss and expresses support to the family members, relatives and all Armenians of the fallen servicemen. Western Armenia strongly condemns another criminal act of Azerbaijan. After the war 2020, especially the Martinu region of Artsakh was blockaded from three sides and the settlement of the region from different sides were under the direct target of the enemy. At a distance of several hundred meters and an altitude, an Azerbaijani detachment is located, considering all the movement of the village. The village of Norshen was founded in 18th century, which is why the settlement was named Norshen New Village. There are two ways to achieve Norshen now. One is paved and comfortable, but long. The other is through villages rocky, which mountains gorgeous and accompanied by beautiful landscapes. Working here is a distant dream. The church was built by the first resident of Tel Karabet village who emigrated for Western Armenia. Azerbaijanis have been working on village far from the last 100 and 150 years who have constantly committed crimes and killed villagers. The villagers claim that they cannot live together with a the Turk. There are 55 students in the village school. The road leading to school is under the direct side of the enemy and the children are playing in a country yard of the building. What place will Armenia, including Artsakh, have on the future political map of Western Asia? The total area of 41.2 thousand square kilometers, which is long loaded, is not enough to have a viable state. The only support of our country is about 10 million Armenians and their unfulfilled rights. However, Western Armenia also faces a serious problem, the threat of assimilation. If joint efforts are not made today, with an emphasis of the preservation of Armenians, the loss of Armenian national identity will become a universal threat to Western Armenia. 
Armenia. If Eastern Armenia and Western Armenia are not united by the rights of the motherland, then they will be doomed. While the Armenians are not great yet, it is at least navy to talk about Armenian demands and Armenian geopolitics. The reorganization of Western Armenia is imperative for the strengthening of Armenia and Artsakh. This is stated in a message of the Catholic House of Great House of Cilicia, Aram I. The Supreme Patriarch in the declaration noted that the Armenian nation confronts a variety of challenges and Western Armenia over. Because that's where there is uncertainty, the struggle against the storms, the search for identity that will make an urgent imperative reorganization and rethinking of Western Armenia. In the city of Zeytun in Western Armenia and a province of the same name in total, in 7018-1909, the Zeytunians took up firearms 41 times to protect their lives and rights. In Zeytun, Armenians engaged in handicrafts, trade, agriculture and gardening. The Zeytunians were also deported and massacred, but this is not the end. The people of Zeytun who escaped the genocide in 1913s once again showed the will to live in their homeland. They founded the North Zeytun Quarter in the northern part of the capital of Republic of Armenia in Yerevan. Now the musical part, Armenian folk song. The full version of this video is available on Western Armenia's YouTube channel. This was all for today. Goodbye.